Yo, what's going on, people? It's your boy U Logic, aka Blonde Baby, aka Slim Shady, aka the most handsome plant poppy to ever grace the face of YouTube. What up? I really just wanted to make this video to catch up with you guys and to more importantly give you an update on the channel and what's going on in my life. We can start with the latter of the two. So, what's going on in my life right now? So, just to get it out of the way, I started a plant business. NYC Plant Nerd and I started it back in the summer of 2019 I would say in terms of like development right now it's kind of like in the awkward stage of middle school where it's you know it's, it's growing and maybe it's starting to see some of like some hair in places that is never seen before one of its limbs is like longer than the other for some reason and people keep people continue to ask it like yo like what's up are you okay like why are you wearing size XL when you're clearly a size small or size medium? And it's telling them, no, because I am an XL. I fit an XL. So this business has definitely been the project that I've been putting the most energy into aside from YouTube. And part of me wants to apologize to you guys for not being as consistent as I could be on this platform. One of the qualities about me that I'm trying to work on, but I'm also I'm not that ashamed of is the fact that I like to work on a lot of things and when something new catches my interest or when I feel like my energy needs to be put 100% towards like one project in particular, I'm not afraid to drop the other thing and that's pretty much what happened with YouTube. But do you guys remember a few months back when quarantine started and I was like really posting like regular content? That's kind of like the flip mode where I kind of took a break from NYC Plant Nerd and I decided to focus on the YouTube channel. But now I find NYC Plant Nerd requiring a lot of energy because ultimately it is a business that I started and it is a business that I want to see be successful and grow, you know, get out of that developmental stage in middle school. I want NYC Plant Nerd to grow out of that stage and really bloom into what it's meant to bloom into. What is it meant to bloom into anyway? What even is NYC Plant Nerd? I haven't told you guys. NYC Plant Nerd is a business that I created with the intention to really create a space for people of color to reconnect with plants, specifically house plants. Now, how do we achieve this? Well, we have three tenets that we commit to here at NYC Plant Nerd. One is community involvement, the second one is plant care education, and then the third one is going to be making healthy house plants accessible to everybody, and I mean everybody. So to talk a little bit on community involvement, one of the cool things that I've been able to do with NYC Plant Nerd is essentially go back to my high school and start a gardening club. So I co-launched it with a teacher that I knew from the school, someone who was into gardening, and together we created a space for students, all students of color, because the school is entirely students of color. We created this space for them to just engage in gardening projects. And I told the teacher when I, when, you know, we were brainstorming, what is this club gonna look like? I told her I want for it to be a moment for students to disconnect from what's going on outside, what's going on in school, what's going on at home, and just have a space to exist in plants. You know what I mean? Like, you ever have those moments where like, say you're propagating or say like you're watering your plants and you're just in the zone. It's really good. And those type of like mental breaks from the stresses of life, that is exactly what inspired me to get serious about plants in the first place. And to be honest, that's what's helped me so many times with my own mental health. Additionally, if you're watching this video on the YouTube social platform, then you're most likely aware of how important social media is to not only any business or brand, but just to community involvement in general. And I say all of that to say that NYC Plant Nerd is on Instagram. We've really been thriving on the platform. And the latest thing that we've been able to do is celebrate Latinx Heritage Month. Something to me as a black Latinx individual that is obviously important. And then by far, the coolest thing that I've been able to do with NYC Plant Nerd is create the Black Lives Matter tea collection. I'm gonna just go ahead and roll the promotional video for the collection. It features two different color shirts, the forest and then the black. Each shirt corresponds with a specific NYC-based organization that is involved in the betterment and enrichment of black lives. 100% of the profits for the forest color will be donated towards Integrate NYC, a youth-led organization that stands on a platform of equity and integration for all NYC schools. And then 100% of the profits generated from the black color will be donated towards the Center for Court Innovation, a nonprofit that works to fundamentally reform the criminal justice system. Each shirt has been sustainably and ethically made and will be retailing for $20. The collection will be going live on nycplanner.com on August 1st. 
So through this collection, I'm so proud to say that we at NYC Plant Nerd have been able to raise over a thousand dollars to be donated towards Integrate NYC and the Center for Core Innovation. What I'm gonna go ahead and say is that if you're interested in doing your own purchase of a BLM tea, down in the description below, I'm going to have the link to the BLMT's collection so that you can buy one yourself and donate towards the organization of your choice. Do keep in mind that supplies are limited and we're actually selling out of some of the sizes. So if you're gonna act on it, act on it fast because they're not gonna last much longer. Wow, so that's a lot that NYC Plan Run has done so far. Let's talk about the moving forward with NYC Plant Nerd. One of the main goals that I have with the business is to eventually be able to sell healthy house plants to anybody and to make them really accessible for everybody. So I'm really proud to announce that NYC Plant Nerd is working really hard so that in the spring of 2021, we will successfully be able to launch the Plant Nerd Starter Box. But the most important thing about this product that I wanna let you know is that this product is going to be affordable just because it's so important at NYC Plant Nerd to make plants accessible to everybody. I don't think that cool house plants, healthy house plants, I don't think that we should be charging them at a premium. In fact, I really do feel as if they should be accessible to people. So I wanna make the box as affordable as I possibly can, all because plants are so, so, so helpful in mental health, especially in my own life. And I wanna be able to like promote that and push that to someone else's life. All right, so I've said a lot about NYC Plant Nerd. What does that have to do with you? Well, like I said before, I've been going back and forth between NYC Plant Nerd Urban Logic, NYC Plant Nerd, Urban Logic. I haven't really had the chance to balance the two. And one of the things that I'm going to be challenging myself to do is to find some type of balance between the two. Because yes, this channel is a plant channel, but ultimately this is my personal plant channel. And I like to use it to talk about my collection, to talk about, you know, things personal to me. NYC Plant Nerd on the other hand, there's a much bigger picture with that. All of that brings me to the future of this channel what will be happening to this channel? I really wish I could sit here and tell you, you know, give you a definitive answer of where this channel will be a few months from now. The only thing I know is that for the near future, I will be making it a mission to post regularly. But what I do want to announce is the launch of a new channel, the official YouTube channel for NYC Plant Nerd. This, this for sure, is gonna be continuing for a long time. In this channel, I wanna be able to not only bring over my audience from in, you know, the NYC Plan Nerd Instagram, but I also wanna bring over you guys, my, don't tell the other ones, but my favorite audience. We've been through so much, you and me, man, like, we, we tight. I want you guys with me wherever I go with whatever project I embark on because I don't want my life to be a secret and I've been feeling like I've been keeping this business under wraps from you guys for way too long. I've had it for over a year and I haven't told you guys, come on. And really the only reason I haven't told you guys about it is because I'm still working on it and I really had this vision in my head that by the time I announced it to you guys, I was already selling the plant box, selling plants to people and I would be able to offer you guys these amazing deals on plants because you know of course I'm gonna give my YouTube fam the hookup man. And with all that being said, I'm realizing I can't keep waiting for the perfect moment to do anything. I just need to spit it out into the universe. I'm doing this. I have a business. NYC Planner is my business. That's my baby right now. You you know, this channel is my baby too, but this is my new baby. You know, I gotta give it a little bit more attention, a little bit more love. So with that being said, I just wanna tell you guys that I am 100% here to be for you guys. Like I said, this is my personal channel. I just don't want to feel like I'm leaving you guys in the dark. So once again, if you're interested in following everything that has to do with my business, one, you can follow the Instagram page at NYC Planner down in the description below. Second, you can also follow the YouTube channel for NYC Plant Nerd. We already have some content planned and I'm hoping that by the time I upload this video, I already have some videos posted on that channel. So, you know, if you want to, you can subscribe to that. Whatever you want to do, Instagram, YouTube, I really recommend you do both of them. Obviously, there's going to be different content for different pages, but it's up to you. I am promising you guys eight videos for the month of November, so stay tuned for that. And we have so much to talk about. Look at my pepperonia. Look at this new monstera. Ah! With all of that being said, guys, hope you enjoyed it. And until next time, peace. Man, it's been so long since I did this. Ooh.